I was born in Gander, Newfoundland, April 28, 1984. Mom Wanda, Dad Albert. Started singing in church. The first song I sang was This Little Light of Mine. Grandpa, Pop Coos, played accordion in the church band. Mom would sing Away in a Manger to me every night as a child to put me to sleep. In elementary school, I started singing in the choir and doing solos. When I was eight, I moved from Newfoundland to Malton, Ontario in order for mom and dad to find work. I got a karaoke machine for Christmas when I was 10 and I didn't put the mic down ever since. I started to sing karaoke in public at 10 years old. I told my mom to take me anywhere I could be heard. I began taking music very seriously when I turned 13. I would write letters to record labels and famous singers, but I never did hear anything from them. When I was 16 years old, my dad and I went fishing in Georgetown, Ontario. Across the street from the river where we were fishing was a local bar called Nashville North. I had always wanted to go there to sing. They were holding an all-ages karaoke contest. After taking second place, a company named Opry North encouraged me to enroll in their showcases. I then performed live with the band for the first time at the Stampede Corral in Kitchener, Ontario. After a couple of years of touring malls, theaters, and, and Ontario's bar club circuit, my parents had moved back to Newfoundland and I was by myself. I was at a point where the money I was making was just not getting me by. I had to leave my place of residence and made my car my home for a little while. It was the loneliest place I've ever been. I left Ontario to move back home with my family. I was pretty much at rock bottom, so I started bartending at a local pub called Fraser's in Gander. There I met some incredible people who had some amazing life stories to tell me. I then realized that my life just wasn't so bad. My mom said, why don't you audition for Canadian Idol? For years, I had argued with my mom and dad that Idol was just not for me. I thought to myself, you know what? I really have nothing to lose, so I made a promise to my mom and dad that I would audition. To my surprise, I was a top six finisher in Idol. To this day, it still overwhelms me when I think back about where I was and where I am today. Now, what about tomorrow?